How's it going out there? I can see you just off in the distance. My name is Private Williams, and I'd like to welcome you to today's adventure as we come back from war to celebrate VE Day. I hope you're all doing well out there this morning. Can everyone give me a wave and let me know who you are and where you are, boys and girls? Oh, fantastic. I tell you what, we're going to get going in a minute, but I'm just going to remind you of a couple of things you might need along the journey. First of all, mums and dads, you may have seen my video pre uh, this broadcast saying you needed a pen and paper. Now, what I want you to do is help us. We need to have our code ready to come home on the ship later on. So, if you've got your pen and paper, mums and dads, what you need to do is write out the alphabet along here across the top. Look, can you see that, bud? All right. And then underneath every letter, okay, from A to Z, all right, I want you to write one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Oh, you don't need me to do every number, do you? All right. So, tidy. So, what, what you're going to do, you're going to do every letter, all right? And then you've got to do every number underneath, okay? Do you think you can do that, but Can you do that for me? All right, because your, your boys and girls are going to need that later on, see? Okay? All right, tidy. Now, what else you'll need is a ball, all right? You're going to need a ball later on, so please find a ball if you haven't got it yet. You're going to need six cuddly toys or similar items from around your house and you're also gonna need a scarf all right okay right i'm so excited i'm gonna burst all right are you all ready to go out there yeah master's ready to go look matt and will in blowfield near norwich i've never been there but i tell you a long way away maybe i can go on my way back from germany ah hello body alex and summer from london all right Eva and Millie are here, hello. Lucas and Isaac in Leeds, hello, but all right, who else is here? Okay, Corporate Pippa and Tim, hello. All right, it's lovely to see you all, I think. Oh, Amy, Eleanor, Cray, hello, how are you doing this morning? You doing well? All right, it's tidy there. You ready to go on the adventure? Yeah, MMG Davis as well. You ready to go on the adventure? All right, let's go. I'm so excited. All right, guys. Oh! I'm out here on the front line in Germany. We've been battling and we've been we've been shooting and we've been crawling through the mud for years now, and it's getting so hard. But we've just received word some captain's orders are coming through in the form of a red book. So let's try and find it. Let's try and find the red book as it comes into us. Oh, here it is! Look, here's the red book. Let's have a look. What the captain's got to say, shall we? All right. Captain has said, listen up, boys. Listen up, troops. All right, you ready? Listen up, boys and girls at home as well. Right. Captain Washington has said, today is going to be marked as Victory in Europe Day. Okay? For those of you who aren't Welsh, that's Europe. Okay? I said Europe. Europe. Okay? Europe, I say. All right? Okay, go with it, right? Okay. Captain Washington has said, today is marked as victory in Europe day. We have defeated Hitler, and now we are ready to bring some soldiers home. Oh, oh, we're going to get to go home. I'm going to get to see my sweetheart. Oh, it's going to be amazing. Right, now, first of all, we have to get ready for the journey home. But there's one important final part of our mission which is putting the flag up in front of the troops to show everyone that Britain and the Allies have been victorious. Are you all ready to do that with me? Are you all ready to do that with me? Sophie and Freddie from Haddenham, are you ready to do that with me? Sergeant Stanley, are you ready? Lily and Elsie and Barnsley, are you ready to do that? And Amy and Sophie, Anne and Harrig and Gwill, and Emily in Heath in Bristol. Okay, and Leo in Swansea, but up at our way, All right, Ari, Molly, and Nico as well. Are you ready to go? And Lily, age five. All right, let's go. I've got my own help, but I have to get little Thomas. Right, me and Private Thomas, we are going to get ready to take our flag from here. Hold your flag in your hand. Everyone got a flag in their hand, but all right, and we got to get it over there. 
And we've got to plant it in the ground. But there's lots of things on the way, guys, because it's been a war zone out here. So first of all, we need to be able to run fast, okay? When I say run, we're going to run around like this really, really fast. But if I say freeze because I see danger, you've got to stop as quick as you can. Do you think you can do that for me, Matt? All right, everyone, come here then. When I say, is everybody ready? You're going to say, reporting for duty, Private Williams. All right. Oh, I've never been in charge before being a private. I'm normally the one at the front, just ready to go into battle. I'm so excited. All right, are you excited, Thomas? Fantastic. Okay. Is everybody ready to go? Reporting for duty, Private Williams. Oh, I'm so excited. Three, two, one. Go, running around. I feel go, running around. All right, everywhere you go, running through the battlefields. All right. All right. Well done, running around. Let's go, go, go. And everybody freeze. Oh, not bad freezing. I can see you moving around at home. Stop wiggling that bottom, please. Three, two, one. Off we go again. Come on, running around, guys. Off we go, but Come on, Tidy. Oh, I love it, Thomas. I love it. Oh, I'm so excited. We're going to go home to Wales. But, oh, I tell you, it's going to be amazing. Freeze. All right, not bad. Right, guys, sometimes, all right, there might be some fire flying around, okay? So if I shout out, everybody take cover, you're going to get down on the floor like this and you're going to go, duck, okay? So if I say take cover, you've all got to get down and duck. Should we have a practice, boys and girls? All right, with me then, guys. Everybody, take cover! Dutch! Fantastic. Up we'll get again then. Up we'll get again. Let's try it again, should we, boys and girls? All right. Are you ready? Take cover! Dutch! Fantastic. Three, two, one. Off we go again, guys. Off we go. Well done. Moving around and freeze. Take cover. Oh, you boys and girls are so good. I think you can come and join the army with me, I tell you. All right, who else is out there? Waving our flags. Arby's ready. Seth and Nancy in Cardiff. Major Rose. Hello, Major Rose. Very important. Charles in Leeds. Matteo Bonifitz. Bonifacio, I love that name. Matt's ready, okay. Ev did a World War II film in a class. Oh, lovely still. All right, next thing we're going to need to do, guys, we're going to have to crawl through the mud. So everybody get down on their bellies. All right. And you're going to put your arms out and your legs out and your arms out and your legs out. Let me see you commando crawling through the mud. Oh, it's so hard. Oh, this sticky mud. How are you getting on, Private Thomas? You doing all right? Well done. All right. Quick through the mud. And take cover. Duck. Oh, and three, two, one. Up we go again. I'm running around. Up we go again. Running around, all right? Running around. And freeze. Okay, the final bit, guys. Get up to the side, all right? We're going to have to tiptoe up really quietly. And we're going to plant our flag in the floor. Okay, ready? Come with me then. Everybody, right on the side then, tidy. All right. Are you all ready, everybody? Three, two, one. Creeping through. Creeping through. And plant your flag in the ground. And turn around to the troops. And say, we've won, everybody. Give us a big shout. We've won, everybody. I can't hear you. We've won, everybody. Oh, fantastic. Harry and Albie and Ruth Erin. Doing well up there, aren't you? Private Brooks as well, look. Emily and Cheltenham, love it, okay. Josh, Ethan and Ruth are reporting for duty in Cardiff. Love that as well. Not sure what Private Thomas is doing over here. Okay. Oh, right. I've got to look for the next orders, all right? So, come and listen, and let's have a listen to see what the next orders are from the captain, okay? Oh, 
Private Williams, you've been very brave. Oh, that's me, that is. He says I've been brave. Can you please tell all the children they have been very brave too? Oh, boys and girls. Captain Eisenhower says you're being really brave as well, okay? Come through, Mr. Washington, that is. All right. Now, oh, we must get into our Sherman tank. Oh, into the tank, see? Because we've got to navigate through the minefield to get back to the border. All right, so we're going to have to get in the big tank. And the tank we're going to use is called a Sherman tank. Oh, so I tell you a little bit about it. There's loads of them out here. I tell you, Sherman tank came in about 1942. So three years ago we've had them. All right, there's about 50,000 of them now. America started making them. 50,000 on the war front. How many is that? That's loads. Okay, it's really cool, like right? big green made of metal, tanks through everything. Only problem is, when they sent them over from America, okay, the gun, the gun turret, it only turns 15 degrees. So it's great for protection, but sometimes it's not so good for shooting at the Germans. Okay, however, we've got to get in our Sherman tank and we've got to get through the minefield. Are you ready to get through the minefield? Okay, this is how we do it. Remember those six items I asked you to find? I want you, to scatter them around the floor. Can you scatter them around the floor, Private Thomas? Okay, all around the floor, look. Okay, and these are going to be our mines, okay? Can everyone see them on the floor there, look? Scatter them around your floor, okay? And, and oh, yeah, we have one of we, guys. Thanks for shouting out, all right? Now, we're going to get one of our privates. You might need to get yourself a mum, a dad, a brother or sister, Whatever you've got in the house, all right? Okay. And we're going to put a blindfold around them. Okay? So get your blindfold and put them around so that your mum or your dad or your brother or your sister, whoever it is, can't see. Can you see, Private Thomas? No. Private Thomas can't see. Look, I can do anything. Na, 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 na. Na, 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 na. He can't see anything. Look, I ah, can't see me. Can you? Oh. You can't see me. We're having a right laugh out here, I tell you. We're having a right laugh. Okay. Can you let me know in the comments when you're ready with all your minds scattered around the floor and your mum or your dad, whoever you got with you, all blindfolded up? You're ready? I can't hear you. Are you all ready? Fantastic. Let's go. Now, you're going to stand at the back and your job is to try and negotiate the way through the minefield without your mum or your dad touching any of the mines with their feet. So he can't see now, so you're going to have to be very, very careful in the instructions that he'll give out, okay? So, for example, if I said, oh, well done, Elias is in his tank, I like it. Okay, Leo's ready as well, look. Oh, nice, Natasha, thank you. Okay, so we're going to have to be very, very careful, okay? So if I was to say, Private Thomas, walk five steps forward. Oh, no, he's exploded because he's hit the thing, all right? So I need to be very careful with what instructions I give. So everyone together, you can watch what I do. And at the same time, I want you to try and get your own private across the room through the minefield, all right? Okay, Private Thomas, are you ready? Everybody home, are you ready? Reporting for duty, Private Williams. Three, two, one. Okay, Thomas, take two steps forward. Stop. One more step forward. And one little step forward. That's enough? All right. Can you take one step directly to your right? This is your right. Oh, lovely. Look at him go. Can you take two big steps forward, Private Thomas? One. Two, all right. Can you take three little steps forward? One, two, three, and look. Private Thomas has made it through. Look, guys, look. He's made it through. Can we have a round of applause for Private Thomas? All right, this time, Private Thomas, can you stand over here? Okay, I'm going to make it a little bit harder. Okay, you can swap at home if you like as well. All right. And Private Thomas is going to try and get me through, all right? So, Private Thomas, I'm gonna shout out that everyone's ready, all right? 
and it was going to get me through, okay? Okay, Private Thomas, are you ready? Yeah. Boys and girls at home, are you ready? Reporting for you, to Private Williams. I love it, I love it. Okay, over to you, Thomas. Take two steps forward. Two steps forward? One step to your right. One step to my right. One step, one little step. One little step forward. Um, step to your right. One step to my right. Um, three steps forward. One, two, three steps forward. Oh, I nearly hit the wall, did I, Thomas? Oh, can I take my blindfold off now? Oh, fantastic! Look, we made it across the minefield. Can you let me know if you made it across? Oh, well done, Cathy Coulthard. No exploded mines in your room. We don't want any insurance claims, do we? Coming in from Coulthard's now. All right, Private Emily, Emily and Heath ready, okay? Did you all make it through? Fantastic. Now, we need to clear the mines. So, when I say three, two, one, I want you to dash around, quickly pick them all up, and pop them into a safe pile now that we've defused them all. Is everybody ready? Is everybody ready? Three, two, one. Let's go get them quick. Get them all up. Get them all up. Pop them in the corner safely. Pop them in the corner safely. Oh, fantastic. Boys and girls, you are doing so well. I'm so impressed. All right, now, let's see what Captain Washington has got for us next. So, we've planted the flag, we've got through the minefield, back to the borders. Okay, oh, we're gonna catch a ship home, guys. We're gonna go across the water, and, oh, you just need your papers. Have you got it? You got your papers, your passport and stuff to get it? Oh, no, I haven't got them. I haven't got, have you all got a pen and paper at home? All oh, right, I remember now, this, is where you're gonna need this thing. That your mum and dad's needed, right? Okay, and together with me and Private Thomas, we've gotta find some clues to write out our boarding pass. So, have your pen and paper ready, and have your alphabet ready, and come with me and Private Thomas. We're gonna need to do some running around now, though, in Cali. Is everybody ready? Ready, Private Williams! Three, two, one, let's go, running around. We've got to have a look, see if we can find something to help us. See if we can find something to help us. And freeze! Take cover! I'm not sure what's coming. Take cover! Oh no, it's okay. It's okay. It's just a royal world. I'm going to sing song it is. Off we go again, guys! Off we go again! Oh, doing so well. I'm impressed, guys. So well. And freeze! Take cover! Commando crawling! Commando crawling! Where's the first clue? Where's the first clue? Oh, I found it, guys, I found it! Oh, look, guys! All right, so, now, I found the first clue, all right? So, what you need to do is find the numbers on our alphabet, all right? Look up, and that'll be the letter that goes with our alphabet. So, we have two, 18, nine, 20, 19, oh sorry, 29, 19, and 8. All right, so have a look at our alphabet. Can you find 2, 18, 9, 20, 9, 19, and 8? All right, whilst me and Private Thomas try to find another clue, can you post in the comments if you know what word is the first word to put on our papers? Are you ready? All right, let's go. I'm so excited to be going home. It's amazing. Let's go. Three, two, one. Off we go. Come on, Private Thomas. Let's go. Come on, Private Thomas. Let's go. All right. Oh, freeze. Oh, no. Carry on. It's fine. Carry on. Freeze. Oh, you're good at this freezing, aren't you, Private Thomas? Right. I can see clue number Two. All right, now let's have a look then. Can you find the right letters? Anyone find it? British. Well done, Natasha. Well done, Samantha Speaks. All right. So, 
The first word the guys have got it on here is British. What does this one say then? One, 18, 13, 25. Oh, these guys are Bletchley Park, all right, giving out all these codes. I don't know what they mean, all right, it's hello. I got to try and get all the brainy ones to work it out, like. Okay, because see, Bletchley Park is a place, like, where they have all the code breakers. And it's all clever people sat behind what we call computers, but they're like manual machines, really, trying to work out what codes are. Huh, they cracked one called the Enigma. They reckon that's half the reason we won the war. All right, who's got this one? One, 18, 13, 25. All right, should we go and find another? All right, let's go, Private Thomas. Three, two, one, off you go. Running around, running around, Carly, like it, eh? trying to find a clue. All right, keep going. Keep going, freeze! Take cover! Commando crawling! Commando crawling! We don't want to get seen now, like, there's still a lot of friendly fire going on, guns going off all over the place. Freeze! Up you get! I found one, guys, I found one, it's up here, look! You see it all along? Oh no! Right, so. Oh, lots of people are getting this now, look, Natasha, Susanna, Kathy, Lazy, Samantha, Lucy. Stu, William, Lizzie, look, they've all got British Army so far. He said, what's this one then, boys and girls? 13, 1, 25. I bet I can't get that one. It's too hard, like, isn't it? 13, 1, 25. You got it? Have you got it? All right, let's, should we go and find the last one? All right, Brian Thomas, are you ready? Three. Two, one, let's go, off we go, fly around, look, have a look around, what can we find? Oh, I can't see anything, look, where's it gone? Where's it gone, please? Tiptoeing up, look, tiptoeing, I think we've got to sneak this one off the officers, all right? Got to sneak it off them officers. Can you reach it, Private Thomas? No, look, let's see if you can reach it. Oh, well done, all right, take it to the screen then. All right, now. So, who, oh, me, well done, Natasha, well done, Kathy. oh, well done, Andrea, Samantha, I'm not sure what I was written at the end there, like, all right, so, the fourth one, two, 15, one, 18, and four, two, 15, one, 18, and four. Who can get it, guys? Hello. Once you've got it, if you put all four clues together and put them in the comments, that will give you access to come on a ship with me, like, and Captain, and Private Thomas. Anyone got it yet? Oh, let's see. Oh, fantastic. Well done, everyone. Come on, Private Thomas. Let's get ourselves on the boat and wait for everyone else to join us. Come on a boat, Private Thomas. You can go in front of me. Okay. We're going to put our hands on the shoulder of the person in front, and we're just going to sway across the sea. Oh, we're swaying across the sea. We're swaying across the sea. Who's coming with us? Oh, look. Susanna, well done. Let us know who's coming on board. Oh, Grace is on board, look. Well done. Let's keep going on board. Across, we're bobbing across the sea. We're going back to Great Britain, okay, and jump off the ship at the end, whoa, and we made it back to Britain, guys, oh, where are we, where are we, to Dover, we're in a place called Dover, now I know, I've got to get back to South Wales, I saw some people in here, you've got to get back to Leeds, like, it's going to take us a while, a motorbike. Oh, Captain says he's got us a motorbike. Oh, fantastic. Right, everybody, grab your ball now. All right, and your ball is going to be the front wheel of your motorbike. All right, put your foot on your ball like this. Grab hold of the handlebars of your motorbike. And when I say three, two, one, I want to hear a rum, rum, rum. Okay, can I see a rum, rum, rum in the comments? Like, let me know everyone's got off the boat. All right, give us a vroom, vroom, vroom. Okay, right. Is everybody ready? 
Vroom, vroom, vroom. Oh, not bad, like not bad, not bad, eh? All right, one more time. Is everybody ready? Vroom, vroom, vroom. Okay, now, as I've never driven a car or driven a motorbike before, I expect, okay, you've got to listen to these rules, all right? If I say it's a red light, you've got to stop at the traffic lights like this, all right? If I say it's an amber light, we're going to get ready, okay? And when we get ready, we put one foot, then the other foot, and we're revving our engine, we're going, rum, 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 or if you're very good, you can do it fast, like Pina Thomas. I'm a bit slower though, okay? And then when I say green light, okay? When I say green light, we're going to go riding our motorbikes all around like this, making sure the wheel of our motorbike stays really close, all right? So, red light! Okay, stop of the lights. Fantastic, guys. Amber light! Rum, 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 rum. And Green light, off you go on your motorbike. You keep riding around on your motorbike, Private Thomas, and I'm going to give a shout out to some of the boys and girls who've joined us today. Oh, brum, I like that, Samantha, Natasha, Lucy, love it. Let us know who your children are, boys and girls, and where you're watching from today and taking part, and we'll give you a little shout out before we finish, I promise. All right, off we go, guys. Rumble, rumble. And red light! Stop at a red light, everybody! Amber light! And green light! Off you go! Green light! And red light! Okay, guys. Oh, boys and girls are doing so well, like. Hello. Now, well done, Private Brooks, with a vroom vroom, I like it. Now, every now and again, guys, we come across a roundabout, okay? Now, when your mum and dad are driving, they drive straight over the top of the roundabout. They do. Charles, your mum drives across the top of the roundabout. Tell her not to, she's got to go round the outside, all right? Okay, all right. Oh, look, Noah, Noah lives near Dover. He's probably nearly home by now, look. Molly, Ariana and Nico, they're going to be on the road with me, like on MA roads. No motorways built yet in 1945. Didn't have any motorways until the 60s, tell. Okay, Private Eagles, Bristol, oh, they'll be coming with us as well, like, look. Oh, look, Pontefract, we got Daisy, look, all sorts. Pippa and Tim and Stockville, Bedfordshire, we can drop them off on the way, that's fine. Okay, this has been awesome. Leo's an army man, I love it. Okay, hello, Henry. All right, Private Brooks, okay. Let's get back on our motorbikes then and look out. When I say there's a roundabout, we're going to go round and round and round in a big circle with the inside of our foot, okay? All right. So, are we ready, guys? Red light. Amber light. Ram, 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 ram. Green light. Off you go. Oh, I didn't do my toe tap. Did I, Thomas? I'm sorry. Ram. Where's our roundabout? Round and around and around in a circle. Round in a circle. And red light. Oh, well done. Amber light. Rumber, rumber, rumber. And green light. Off you go. Well done. Round. Round. And red light. Oh, guys. We're halfway there. We've got to fill up with petrol, all right? So, everyone. Pull the petrol nozzle out, put it in your motorbike, and when I say fill it up, you're gonna go roll it out foot across the top of the board. Can we have a go at that, Thomas? Up we get then. So everybody, fill it up! Red light! Amber light! Rumble, 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 and green light. Off you go again. Round. All right, we've gone past London, guys. We've passed London. Rumble, rumble. Oh, we're past Reading. We've gone past Reading. Anyone from Reading? In? Oh, there's Swindon. Hello, Swindon. Let's drop those guys off at of Bristol on the way. Drop them off at of Bristol. Oh, oh, there's no bridge. Oh, no. There's no bridge in 1945. 
You gotta go the lot on the ferry. Okay, pick it up then on the ferry. Cross the cross the river seven on the ferry. Look. Okay. Back on your motorbike, red light. Amber light, rumble, rumble, rum. Green light, off we go. Round, round. Oh, we're going past Newport. Oh, we're going into Cardiff. Oh, we're going up the valleys. Oh, we're going up to the London. Oh, boys, I can tell you, it's going to be a party in London. A red light. Oh, boys and girls, we've only gone and made it home, haven't we? Oh, I'm so happy. Everyone's out to clap us. Everyone, big round of applause as you clap in, Thomas. Big round of applause as you are clapped in to your hometown. Are you all back in your hometown? Whether it's Leeds or Bedford or Dover or Bristol, wherever you're watching from today. Pontefract, I saw out there as well, didn't I? Okay, and Cardiff. Lovely. Right, guys. There's a little bit more to go, though. Because they've declared today VE Day and they've had a celebration. Oh, so good. They're having a celebration just for us soldiers coming back from the war to celebrate the fact we're not at war anymore. Oh, oh, but first of all, there's something important that they wanted to do. Now, guys, listen up carefully because tomorrow, okay, boys and girls, you in your living rooms, tomorrow at 11 o'clock, everybody across the UK. It's going to stop for a two-minute silence. And the reason we have silence is you may have had them before. Maybe when someone has died, we've gone to a funeral, or on the day of remembrance every year, Remembrance Sunday. And what we do is we stand nice and still, okay, really quiet, and we stay thoughtful just to think of all those people who have given their lives for us. So tomorrow at 11 o'clock, when you tell mums and dads, but everyone's going to go outside and be really quiet for two minutes. Think you can do that for me? All right, should we have a little practice then? No comments, mum and dad. We'll do 20 seconds, all right? Ready, steady, go. Oh, guys, that was fantastic. I'm so impressed that you could stay quiet for that long. Give yourselves a big round of applause. Now, the last thing they said is we've got to have a family and we've got to have a celebration. So go and find your family. Here's my family coming up. Oh, give them a big hug. Give them a big hug. Give your family a big hug. Oh, well done. Oh, it's so lovely to see you. And we're going to have a party and we're going to have a music. So, can you come and have a bit of music with us? Are you ready to have a dance? Okay, ready. Steady. Thomas, you ready for dancing, Matt? Thomas is ready for dancing, I can tell you. Okay, so. We're dancing today. Get yourselves ready. You've got to put your arms out like this. Okay. And we're going to be going like this. Okay. Let me see those arms out wide and your toes pointing. Oh, I love it. Can you wave your hands as well? <laughs> Grab your mum or dad, whoever's with you. Link arms like this. All right, link arms like this one here. And we're going to go round in a circle as well. And then back next to him and get those legs going again. Oh, well done, everybody. Well done, guys. I'm so impressed. Oh, boys and girls, I hope you've had a lovely time. It's been wonderful to see you here today. All right, remember, tomorrow, Friday the 8th of May, is the 75th anniversary of VE Day. Please take some time to remember those who've given their lives for us and do that two-minute silence at 11 o'clock. Thank you so much for joining us today. I've been Private Williams. This is Private Thomas. Over and out.